let knowledge flow like a river without any hindrance don't make it like a stagnant pool hello everybody i'm ps sarajiv with you welcome to my combi pack for the design of isolated footing by excel part 2 please like share and subscribe my channel this is my excel spreadsheet these are the parameter which we can change this is unit weight of concrete this is load reduction for opening net step bearing capacity increment in net step bearing capacity cover fck fy lx ly cx the column dimension in x direction this right column dimension in z direction de df etc and these are the auto generated parameter in my powerpoint presentation i have discussed how to calculate cg of a section moment of inertia and maximum xm point from cg along y axis and x axis and section modulus etc all the formula i have applied here by clicking this switch you can change the shape of the footing this is trapezoidal type 1 we are considering square footing number of type number of this footing is 1 we can also change here for flat type or trapezoidal type we are changing here trapezoidal type now type 1 and all the geometrical value is automatically generated here actually i have put all the formulas here we have to write here if type 1 then lx by 2 g1 is equal to z2 is equal to lz by 2 like that by the help of vlookup value we are copying all those value to the desired cell that is z1 z2 z3 z1 z2 z3 x1 etc selection of load case calculation for maximum reaction check for sliding and overturning this is our load from stag now this is maximum reaction this is minimum reaction this maximum reaction and minimum reaction should be always positive that means upward for sliding check fy that is vertical load divided by horizontal vertical reaction divided by horizontal reaction is equal to this one and this s will be greater than equal to 1.2 this is the condition for sliding check check for overturn length of in intersection and check here lx is equal to 500 mm lz is equal to 500 mm li is equal to 0.00 it is less than this this value and it is less than this value so it is okay now we have to prepare a table like that calculation for reaction area required critical depth punching area for punching shear for service load here now this is 101 and this is 105 by using vlookup formula one second we are finding that the 105 load case is maximum now area required in 101 load case 4.167 and 5.015 for 105 but we have provided 9 it is too high 2.5 
still it is high. We need 4.9, that is 5, 2 and 2.5, it is okay. Table B, calculation for factor load, effective depth at a distance D from the column space, check for the punching space, percentage of steel provided. This is 100, uh, 201 and 205 of the factor load here. Reaction 201, 462, and 205, 556 kilonewton. Maximum reaction 556. Along x axis, we have provided 12 to 100 dia. Z axis also 12 to 100 dia. AST provided 1.244 millimeter square, 1.24 millimeter square. Percentage of steel along x axis, it is 4.2. 0 0.403 and it is 0 0.4.384. Table C calculation for one way shear stress and bending stress. Shear force per meter. This is our tau V along x axis, along z axis. Calculation for bending moment and bending stress. Percentage of steel required. 0.12, but provided 0.202 and 0.193, so okay. And it is design summary. The footing mark F1, type of footing square LX is equal to LZ, value of LX in millimeter, value of LX LZ in millimeter, AB not required. X column base in X direction 350, column base in Z direction 550, cover 50, DE 200, DF 400, 512, spacing 100, reinforcement along Z direction 5 is equal to 12, spacing equal to 100. Now I am changing the footing type. Say it is trapezoidal base along x axis look here area maximum area required 4.831 but we have provided 7 3.75 so we are changing lx to 2.5 still it is not okay so we are we once again we are changing this to now it is okay. We can also change here B 0.9 meter. Look one second, it is not okay. So we are changing to 1 meter. It is okay. Now regarding space and moment, it is also okay. So the design summary is like that. In this way, we can also design triangular base along Z axis. Look here, once again, the area is not OK. Required maximum 5.354. We have provided 3.75. <clears throat> so, changing this, not okay. Now it is okay. And stress, bending stress, shear stress, all are okay. No. Look here. Bending space is not okay in the z axis. So we have to change the percentage of steel. We can increase diameter. Uh, we are changing the diameter 16. Sorry. 
Versus in a field provided in a much more higher to L to L. You have to change the thickness here. V E point two five. Now everything is okay. And this is all about my combi pack for the design of isolated footing part two. I would like to draw the attention of my viewers. I am going to dedicate the Excel sheet of combi pack for the design of isolated footing. First to Mr. T. Narayan Murthy, Superintending Engineer of Andhra Pradesh Power Generation Corporation. After seven days, I am going to distribute everybody. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel and also evaluate my performance with your valuable comments. Thank you.